اوزبلرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم والاصر ان علی انسان علف خسر اللہ الزین آمن و عامر الصالحات و اتواس و بلق و تواس و بصبر آئی سویر بد ریکلائننگ ڈے مین از اٹ اے لاس سیو دوز ہو ہیو فیت اینڈ دس سال ایکشنس ایکشن دیٹ اللہ لفظ اینڈ دین انوائٹ پیپل ٹو ٹروتھ انوائٹ پیپل ٹو حق انوائٹ پیپل ٹو ریالٹی اینڈ دین کاؤنسل ون آف بی اسٹیٹ فاسٹ ڈیئر بردرز اینڈ سسٹرس ڈسکور یور سیلف اے ورک شاپ has been introduced to you which I started in the year 2002 and this discover yourself workshop is an experiential workshop and this has come into existence of my own personal experience of my life I lived a life of 50 years on my own and I could find that I had gone through many ups and downs in life, failures and success in life, in relationships, in business, in other areas. So I was asking myself the questions why I am so innocent, I am religious, I am educated, I am being good to everyone why such things are happening and why, what is the cause and the remedy for the failures in my life. This was my search. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, I can say that I could able to uncover. Discovering oneself is uncovering the truth, the reality. So I got the solutions to the problems that I went through in life. After going through 50 years of my own experience, I got the solution. And then when I applied in my own life, what I discovered, and my life shifted and totally transformed, and I got the experience of living a life of peace, happiness, joy, contentment in this life. Today, whatever the external circumstances may be, whether it is a failure, whether it is some breakdowns, whether it is anything, I am able to face it. from the background of nothingness, in the background of love, in the background of peace, love and making a difference. This discovery that I got to myself and able to change my own life, transform my life and this education which I got at the age of 15, then I said this education what I got that has to be passed down to all the people in the world. So I, take, I took up as a, my passion, as my duty to myself, that I should spread this education and thus this discovery itself came into existence in 2002 and the journey of this workshop began from the first workshop from Calcutta and till today we are done 370 workshops all over the world. in more than 17 countries in Europe, in USA, Middle East, Asia, in African countries. And thousands of people who have participated in the workshop have really benefited it and really able to see for themselves and then uncover the veils that they were wearing on and living they could see it and remove and able to transform their lives. The basic process of Discover Self is, it is a three day workshop. Sometimes we do in two days, but it requires three days required is because the first day we do not do the workshop. Why? Because the, every person who enters the workshop, it comes with a glass full of water. If I add something, it overflows. So the first day is unlearning. And once we empty, the first day we unlearn, we empty the, all the conditionings that have been done right from the childhood. And thus unconditioning is done. And then first day, the second day, the workshop starts. And that second day, the workshop begins with the fundamentals, with the basic foundations. And those we get the distinctions of the workshop. So the whole workshop is a process 
to uncover the real you inside. That is our whole job. It is not just a topic to be discussed on. It is not certain uh, seminar or some, you can say even uh, or what you can call it as a debate. A nothing, it's nothing. It is a journey that we take you inside. I am just acts as a facilitator to take you within you and to go deeper and deeper and to see within yourself the conditioning that has been done and what is locking you, what is blocking you and unlock that. And that's the what I, my job is as a facilitator, does. And the workshop is that the basic fundamental principle we operate on is that every human being is pure, perfect, whole and complete. There is nothing to change. This is that everybody is a pure diamond. But Allah says they have the whales in front of their eyes. And because of that whales in front of their eyes, they are not able to see the truth, not able to realize the reality. And that's the whole workshop is a process to remove the whales from your eyes. And this, I cannot do it. You have to do it. Only I can guide you to do the whales, to remove the whales from your own eyes. So it takes the process to do it. So we have different modules, different sections, we check on to the end. So next one is, my job is an eye specialist, I call it, because you will get an eye. My job is to give you an eye that can see the truth, the reality. Because Allah says in the Quran that you have the hearts where you cannot understand. You have the eyes you cannot see. You have the ears you cannot hear. You are like cattle. No, it is worse than cattle. So that means we have that fundamentally. Allah has given us the eyes, the faculty of seeing. We have the faculty of hearing. Also, we have the faculty of the heart that is the faculty of realization. And also, we have the faculty of the mind of rationalization. So we have different faculties. And the Quran addresses all those faculties. You have those faculties, but you are not able to use it. It has not been put into potential. So we take you into journey and break open like an engineer engineering. So to dissect and show you the faculties, what it has been there, but they are blind, they are blocked. And now our job is to unlock and remove those blocks, remove the filters, or remove the veils so that you can use the faculties which Allah has given us. And also the main thing is to uncover the real you. So everyone is a diamond, we say. So everyone that enters in the workshop is pure, perfect, whole and complete. Now for example, we say that a, a Michelangelo who was a sculptor, he carved out a marvelous, beautiful, wonderful piece. It is one of the wonders of the world called David. So they, uh, they asked Michelangelo, how could you create such a marvelous piece? It's one of the wonders pieces from that rough rock. The Michelangelo said, already the David was inside the rock. Only I chipped out the extra scales from his mind. The David came out. So you are all Davids. You are perfect, whole. Only some scales and dust is found on your eyes. And our job is to remove those scales. And once you remove those scales from your eyes, from this thing, you emerge up. So in this process, the workshop takes you into a journey inside and reprogram yourself. It is like rewriting your future. Because when your child, that four-year-old child has already written your future for you and we are living that future forever. So this discover yourself is an opportunity to come back, to reformat the disk that has been programmed from the childhood unconditionally, unconsciously by the environment, by the society, by the parents, by your education system, you program yourself. And then in the workshop, we help you to format it and reprogram the whole process of your life. Now we have an opportunity. All the programming that you have done inside you 
is based on the external. From your education, from the parents, from the environment, you program yourself. And you live your life. That is, outside, in life, everyone is living. Most of the people are living. Now, Allah has given us a software. Allah has given us a value systems. Allah has given the principles of life. So those life based we do. And we download that. And then we operate the external from the internal. So this is where we have the, because we have a choice, human beings have a choice to choose to live a way of life, one, my way of life, or I have a choice to live Allah's way of life. We have two ways of life. So a father wants the child to follow his way of life. The mother wants the child to follow his way of life. And the child wants to follow his way of life. And the whole house is in chaos. And the society that you live in wants you to follow their way of life. And the nation you live wants you to follow their way of life. So everyone is imposing their way of life. But where is Allah's way of life? So the workshop helps you to distinguish the consequences of the two ways of life. Living my own way of life, what is the consequences? Living the Allah's way of life, what are the rewards and benefits? So we help you identify, to see that the first is to process we take you through, to know that who am I? not on the basis of external, on real me. Who am I is me, the real me. The next is to take you the purpose of life. Unless we don't have these two questions answered, who am I and the purpose of life, unless you do not know this, we are not able to get the direction. So the workshop helps you, guides you, a process to uncover the real you inside bring out the potentials that you have inside, create a life of possibilities with a con con context of purpose of life. And this is what the whole workshop and the process is about. Jazakallah khair. Thank you.